this question tells us this is discrete random variables in discrete. So we will need our table. Then for the first part, we have to find out what is our n value. Then only we can solve the probability question for the rest. So from here, we build up our table. So for x random variable, we will have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. So this is our random variable and our probability. So we read out the probability here. So for x equals to 1, we see this function. x equals to 1 is x over n. Means 1 over m. Because your x now is 1. When x equals to 2, see it's x squared over m. Means 2 squared over m. 2 squared over m will give us 4 over m. So when 3 will be x over m. So 3 over m. 4 we need here for another formula here is 4 square over and 4 square we get 16 finally 5 here is 5 over n and then 6 here 6 square we get 36 over n 7 7 over n so we finish the whole part of our discrete random variable now we're going to figure out what is our n so as we know, for discrete random variable, we have one properties. The characteristic say that total of the probability must be equals to one. So this question already tells us this is discrete. This random variable will hold for these properties where the total of their probability must be able equals to one. So we total up this probability 1 over m, 4 over m, 3 over m, 16 over m, 5 over m, 36 over m, and 7 over m. So how many m here? They have same denominators. So we just add up the numerator value here. It gives us 72 over m. Then we cross multiply. Uh, 72 over 1 will equal to m. So therefore, we find our m is 72. So once we find our m is 72, so we can figure out our probability already. This is 1 over 72, 4 over 72, 3 over 72, 16 over 72, 5 over 72, 36, 72, 7, 72. So from here we can proceed. For question B, probability of modulus x minus 4 less than equal 4. One. So for this kind of the question, we have to simplify the operation uh, inside the bracket here, which is involving our random variable. When we have modulus, we have to open the modulus. We have to define the modulus. Modulus less than. So the definition will become negative 1 and then less than equal x minus 4 and then 1. So this is a definition of modulus less than. We can revise back. Our syllabus modulus less than, when you open modulus, it can be less than k, more than negative k. So if you have modulus more than, your modulus more than k, or uh, we have definition of modulus less than negative k. So this is our inequality definition. So from here, we have to simplify our bracket here, our random variable first. So we're going to move this negative 4 out. So it will be plus 4. So once it plus 4, it will give us 3. So this is give us 5. So we are going to find our probability for random variable included 3 to 5. So it will be the random variable of 3, random variable of 4, and random variable of 5. So we pick our probability at here, 3 over 72. So for 4, 16 over 72. For 5, 5 over 72. So the rest we can press calculator to simplify. The question C here asks for probability x more than 3.5. Probability x more than 3.5. So we pick the random variable here, which is more than 3.5. More than 3.5 will be 4, 5, 6, 7. It's equal to random variable 4 x equals to 5, x equals to 6, and x equals to 7. So x equals to 4 here, 16, 5, 36, 7. So simplifying by calculator.